opportunity lost again? Or how do you take this this whole thing? Yeah, we want to win this thing, like any game. But uh, you know, playing in front of our home crowd and great fan support. Kids, kids played hard, left on the court. We uh, we wanted this game just like any other game. When, uh, when you lose, it hurts. Williams is alone, and D'Angelo seems to have seems to have had three really good games against him. Could you speak to D'Angelo's game tonight? He did a, he did a good job. Uh, played very focused and. Uh, did a great job on both ends of the court. I thought, even though Williams had phenomenal numbers, uh, I still think. Well, the it's, uh, obviously, Derek is a, Williams is a great rebounder, but uh, just the defense D'Angelo played against Derek. Derek was very complimentary toward him. In fact, uh, I think D's played real well against Derek all three times they've gone against you. How do you feel about uh, uh, D's defense on uh, Williams? Uh, it's, it's wonderful, man. Uh, D'Angelo, he's an undersized center. You know, but he's strong enough, you know, to uh, post up the best of them or guard the best of them. Uh, even if, you know, if I got a chance to play somewhere else or anything, and somebody asks me what post player would I want to play with, uh, nine times out of ten, I'm going to call Castro. You know, that's the confidence I got in him. That's like my brother. You know, even though I'm older than him and he's big than me, this is my little brother, you know. And he fights for us. That's something we do. It's a brotherhood here. You know? And if anyone thinks they're going to come in here and score easy baskets, baskets on the Angelo Castro, you're in for a rude awakening. He's a great defender. Hands down, one of the top centers in the country. I said. Defensively and offensively. 